54 days after the tragic high-rise fire in the Bronx, additional help is reaching survivors and families of the 17 people who perished. CBS 2's Tony Aiello was in Fordham Heights as the Muslim community shared the generosity. The flowers on the memorial have faded since January, but the need for financial assistance has not. So families impacted by the fire at the Twin Parks Northwest Building lined up for aid, crowdfunded by the Muslim Community Network of New York. Mm, it helped a lot. It's helpful. It really showed that the community really cared and were shocked by what had happened. And both Muslims as well as non-Muslims gave to the organization from all over the United States. Aid checks handed out Friday, ranging from $800 to $2,000 per family, depending on size, with an additional $4,000 for each of the seven families that lost loved ones. It's just part of the outpouring of public and private generosity after the January 9th inferno. A fund set up by New York State has distributed more than half a million dollars in monetary assistance. On GoFundMe, the Gambian Youth Organization raised a million dollars. It's given 5000 to each of the 115 families in the building and $10,000 per deceased to their next of kin. There's been aid from the city as well. Fire survivors say it all eases the disruption they've experienced. What's your message to the people who reached into their wallets? They went above and beyond. All I can say is God bless them and thank you. I thank you very much. The Mayor's Fund and other groups that raised money are holding some of it back for future needs. The Muslim Community Network keeping about $40,000 in reserve and planning to spend some of it on a day of community fellowship for these families who've suffered so much. In Fordham Heights, Tony Aiello, CBS 2 News. Many survivors are relocating to a complex in the South Bronx. Only a handful have returned to the Twin Parks Northwest building. And management is paying for hotels through April 7th for those people still looking for housing.